May 4th has always been a Star Wars day for, what, 40 something years, guys, right? Yeah, something like that. But the, the bad guys never got their day. So this is the bad guys day. This is the revenge of the fifth. fifth. The 80s and 90s were great times to be a kid. Join me as I dive into the world of movies, music, video games and toys, and explore what made these decades so great. This is The Big Retro Show. What's up everybody, this is Lowe's and today the Big Retro Show is headed to the Revenge of the Fifth Toy Sale. It's uh, about an hour away from my house and today I'm going to be looking for all the old retro toys. I'm particularly interested in finding a Skeletor uh, off of the He-Man toy line. And uh, of course, the Living G.I. Joe, that was another one of my favorite toy lines uh, growing up. But uh, we'll see what we can find. I'm also going to be looking for some uh, Marvel toys. Uh, I just saw the Indian movie last night and I can tell you that it was an awesome movie. Recommend it if you haven't seen it. Um, I dare you not to cry at the end, just like all of us did. The most dangerous thing is when you cut the aluminum, it's so easy to get cut. So you have to be awfully careful, so it takes some time. I actually do one wing at a time, and then go to the body. So it took about a good two weeks. I, I mean, I don't work on it like hours every day, but it's yeah. a little bit at a time. That is amazing. It's, and what made you have the idea to do that? Uh, maybe I was too cheap to buy a good one. <laughs> My name is Tom Fitzsimmons, and I am the owner and founder of Podigal Collectibles. So we're hosting a toy show here. We have additional vendors outside um, that have their own products, um, and it's not like they're resellers. They're collectors and people like yourselves that want to move some merchandise and refocus to a different area of expertise or they have their own expertise. We've been doing uh, shows in this location for just about 18 months now. This is our seventh show in this location now. How do you feel about the turnout today? Uh, turnout's been very good. Uh, customers have been really good and really happy. Everybody's having fun watching cartoons and playing with toys. Uh, toys have a connection to everything. So. Uh, as, as a child, we usually interact with a specific toy, and we have that toy that we love so much. As we grow older, we lose that connection aspect. So our job is to help our customers relive their childhood one toy at a time. So that way they can get that toy and enjoy life again. You know, my job is to watch cartoons and play with toys all day long. So I have stress because I gotta get the bills paid, but. I do this for the love, I don't do this for the money. But, well, Star Wars is always hot, but just because it says Star Wars doesn't mean it's made of gold. So a lot of people, it seems to think so, but that's not true. Um, realistically, the best sellers that we tend to have is actually Lego. Uh, Lego is one of the hottest items. It's generational, so uh, I played with it when I was a child. My kids play with it, my grandchildren will play with it, my great-grandchildren will play with it. It's a generational toy. Um, Transformers, G.I. Joe's, Star Wars, My Little Ponies, Care Bears um, are all really good sellers. The girls right now, they're loving uh, Littlest Pet Shops and a new toy that came out a couple years ago. It's called LOL. It's basically Littlest Pet Shops, but for Hey guys, this is Lo signing off from the Revenge of the Fifth Toy Show over here at the Pot of Gold Collectibles. Saw a lot of cool stuff and I hope that you enjoyed the show. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell. Also, don't forget to uh, follow me on Twitter and Facebook for the latest updates. Lo signing off from the Big Retro Show.